Orchid Ninja Snow Dragonka san asked me the question Do you still have something in organic media and why? And the answer is yes. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> I still have a dendrobium left from a Kern and Tokyo World Mark that I got last year, still in its nursery pot and still in bark, as well as a Tolumnia. And the reason being, I'm waiting for the right time for them to be able to transition. So it was a little bit out of season when I got them. We were shortly going to be heading into winter and there was no way I'm going to take these orchids apart, put them into Lekka, knowing the evaporative cooling could cause problems. For that reason, I still have these two pots in organic media. And then I still have two mounts also that are cork. And the reason they are still there is because one of them is the Dendrobium Victoria Regina. And I'm scared to switch her over on my inorganic mount setup because she is doing so well for the time being. And oh my goodness, that moss doesn't seem to be growing on my hob material. So yeah, I'm a little bit hesitant to make that transition. And while she's doing well, I'm not going to touch her. And the same with my aphyllum mount, the community mount of Dendrobium aphyllum, Ceratolabium and Cerola. I cannot bring myself to cut into the roots to get the Cerola and the Ceratolabium off. I just cannot bring myself to do it. They've all sort of grown into each other. And I know the time is going to come one day I'm going to have to do it. I'm just not ready at this point in time. So these are my still organic growing pots and mounts and the reasons why I still have them. Thank you for asking Orchid Ninja Snow Dragonka-san.